Hey, today just a quick video. I got a few of these used NSK LW21 linear carriages with rails, which are quite dirty, so I went ahead and disassembled and cleaned them. This video will be about how to reassemble these. Here is an overview of all the parts. Centerpiece made from precision ground steel, one of the plastic cages that hold the walls in place, rubber seals against dirt, metal cages for a second row of bolts, little plastic inserts for guiding the bolts around the corner, plastic end pieces, rubber wipers and seals, grease nipple, mounting screws and of course the bolts themselves. This is one of the end pieces and this plastic guide needs to go in there. I just grab them with tweezers and slide them in like so. This is the end piece where the grease nipple goes in and you can see the slots that guide the grease all the way up to the inserts where the grease meets the bolts. Top view on the main piece. You can see the two return channels and the main bearing channels along with the threaded holes and alignment holes. Starting with one end piece and wiper and simply screw them in place. Nothing special here. Screwing in the grease nipple and the side is done. Now comes the bottom plastic cage which just slides in. The top cages are also just put in like this. It's a bit fiddly to align everything so the other end piece with the wiper can be mounted but also nothing special here. Sliding in the rubber seals and this is also done. Here you can see the two channels with the plastic and the metal cage. Last step is inserting the bolts and for that you can lock the plastic cage like this so it opens up in the middle of the channel. Having the carriage at an angle makes it easier to insert the bolts, just drop them into the channel. I did not count the bolts, but there are about 40 per channel. Be careful not to put in one too much, you might think there is a gap where one more could fit, but no, that would be one too much. Here you can see the first channel working after unlocking the cage. For the top channel I just grabbed the bolts by hand and pushed them in, as the cage is quite springy. And here is the top channel working. Repeat for the other channel. Bottom here is finished and the three at the top were the only ones left over because the person who dismounted the carriage from the rail was not aware how these work and even if these do have cages, bolts can be missing and went missing. Also in the process of cleaning, some went missing in the sink, which was my fault. Fortunately, these are 332nd inch or 2.381 mm, which is a standard size, so I can order some. Mounting the carriages is quite easy, just be careful and slide them onto the rails very slowly in case one ball becomes loose, so just push it in again and proceed. 